Hello everybody, my name is Fretex and welcome back to the Trident. So, yesterday we created our new characters in the world of Westeros and today we're trying to get some more money to actually be able to afford some arms and armor because currently we are just a man with an amazing helmet and some really strange static cloth thing, but it's totally fine. So we're going to be heading towards a little place called, where is it? I think it's over here somewhere, Hornvale, which has the next tournament we can actually go and make some money from. Also, I was thinking between, ooh, hello there. I might try and kill these looters while they're here. Hopefully this guy doesn't intervene. We're okay. Okay, so it might be slightly outnumbered, but as we all know, everybody, looters run away because they are complete cowards. So if I just kill a few of them, they should run away in terror. Men, are we ready to prove we are the strongest men in Westeros? I would take your signs as a yes. Okay. Bowman forward! Yeah! I kind of, I just realized, I've got like some weird like feathers at the back, back of my helmet here. Very strange. Oh, there's trees everywhere. <laughs> I better be a bit careful. I'm renowned for running into trees all the time, so it probably will happen eventually. Hi, friend. Wait, how did I hit you? <laughs> you had your shield up, sir. This is the most unlucky band I've ever seen. Hey, what? How are you still alive, sir? It's that it's that thin shroud he has over his head. It's protecting him. It's actually made out of, like, carbon fiber. Or it's a bin liner. I'm not exactly sure, to be honest. Yeah! Okay, we killed one. I probably shouldn't kill too many because, as I mentioned, they're going to run away very shortly. So if we just move back over here, we're going to have to make these men learn how to fight through combat. Men, it's time. Wait, I haven't got a sword yet. Damn it. <laughs> can I borrow one of your swords? Wow, I'm happy I've got my helmet. <laughs> that could have been a bad situation. Wait, are they skirmishing with us? If they want to do that, that's totally fine. I'll just shoot them. It's not a problem. Excellent. I'm kind of worried of killing too many of them. So, men, it's time. Infer Attack! Go, go, go. Oh, wait, some of them are already running, I think. No, they're not. They're fine. Fight me. I am Arthur Curry, the knight of the realm. Yes, that's right. You cannot defeat me. And apparently, I can't defeat you with my axe. <laughs> I got this. Oh. oh, no. we got to get out of here, man. It's the king of the north. No. Quickly end the battle. We can't stay here for long. Guys, calm down. We're not even in the north. We're, we're next to King's Landing. Okay, we've got, we've got to hurry this up. Okay, wait. It's fine. I've closed down the menu. They should stop seeing King of the North. Guys? Oh, no. They're getting louder. <laughs> we got to get out of here. I'll let you looters go, okay? Guys, guys, come on. Calm down. Okay, I think it's stopping. I think it's stopping. So, um, yeah, this is a mod, everybody. Uh, if I was, say, I don't know, a developer of the mod, maybe I would tone down the King of the North just slightly. I know it's very uh, patriotic, but we're not even in the North. I mean, <laughs> come on. The North's all the way over there. We can hear them from over here. That's, that's too loud. It's too loud, everybody. Okay, Hornvale. So before we actually go into combat here, let me just have a look at the lo local market. Is there my favorite armor here? Let's have a look. We might be lucky, or we might not be lucky at all. Okay, we're not lucky at all. Damn it. Oh, what are these, by the way? Ooh. Very nice. I wonder who that was. I think that's, that's probably one of the Targaryens, I would imagine, by looking at the uh, dragon thing. Wait. Wait a second. It's a hybrid. It's got the Stark Wolf and a Targaryen seal. Maybe this is not correct. I don't know. <laughs> Did this guy actually have some strange hybrid thing? I, I don't know. Let me know, guys. Let me know. Uh, of course, I've not read the book, so I don't actually know everything about these guys. Uh, let's have a look. So, we have some armors and stuff here, but I do not really think there's anything we can really buy. I don't really want to buy any, like, uh, plate boots or plate gloves, because I'm not sure how it would go with the armor I'm going to get eventually. It might, like, mesh or something, so we're just going to leave that alone. If I look at the, um, ooh, I need a sword if I can. There's no swords. Well, there is a sword, but I want a two-handed sword, because I like two-handed swords. Okay, apart from that, let's go and do the tournament. Hopefully I don't die horribly. So imagine, I believe this is going to be like a Valandian tournament, being Lannisters. I guess that's the most closely, uh, this is a, this is a Valandian tournament. There you go. Okay, let's do this. Oh no, they gave me a crossbow. This is a disaster. It's okay, it's okay. I got this. Nailed it. Dave and the shark. Shame me. Wait, wait, wait. Fire! Oh. <laughs> Damn it! The uh, margin of error is very... Wait, it's, they've killed my met. Oh, we, we're in trouble, buddy. We're in trouble. Oh, no. Wait. Oh, no. We got this. 
Oh, I thought he got me there, but it was okay. My friend, aim your crossbow. I'll use it as cover. What? It didn't work. Oh, no. <laughs> Instant karma. It's up to me now. Don't die. Arthur. I got this. Oh, no, I haven't got it. It's a disaster. Protect me. God of barrels. Okay. Oh, that was close. That was a close battle, everybody. <laughs> but we just survived. Uh, luckily, my friend used their lives up there to save me. Okay, let's bet more. Oh. 2v1. I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay, let's try not to attack one group. But let's try and just knock people out as we go. Oh, you're my friend. I don't want to attack you. Target spotted. What? My bad, my bad. <laughs> Ah, oh, I was gonna say, I just noticed the floating rock. It seems every arena has a random floating rock in it for some reason. I'm not sure why. I love how the AI doesn't know how to fight with uh, pole arms at all. <laughs> standing in a circle, stabbing each other. It's pretty funny. At least it's different than a. Uh, this guy looks awesome! Who are you? Oh, he's some kind of Lannister man. Uh, maybe it was a Lannister house guard? Oh, that was very strange. Okay. Oh, that's my guy again. Let's end this folly. Please. This is the strangest horse that I've ever seen in my life. I didn't even know Northerners could use horses. Oh, he's still alive. <laughs> Just look look at this, everybody. What is, what is going on here? Good job, buddy. Good job. This is why you guys lost the war, okay? This is exactly why. Okay, let's do this. 150. Go! I could instantly win or instantly lose. Or nothing, apparently. Okay, we got this. We got this. You've got to be very careful, pole arms, because one good hit and you are screwed. So. Ooh. You can't escape me! Die, you bastard! Yes. You tell him, Arthur. Insult his mother as well. I need to get more uh, distance because we need to make sure the thing attacks properly. There, that's my shot. Come on. Sir, please, this is taking too long. There. <laughs> painful, painful. Okay, I think we've got, what, two more rounds left? And then we should be... No, one round, okay. Once again, it's a random peasant in charge of the final battle. <laughs> oh, I am so slow, everybody. I cannot get over my speed. It's absolutely ridiculous. I'm sorry, sir. You shouldn't even have been in the tournament in the first place. You're not even a soldier. What just happened? <laughs> you became a doll. I'm very confused. Wow, we got like the worst possible helmet I've ever seen. So um, I think we might sell that. I'm going to move on. So we got that out of the way. I kind of tempted, by the way, but I'm trying to get my armor first. What we might do, let's head back towards the north. Is there recruits here? No. Because I want to see if I can get my favourite armour first today. Because we've definitely got enough money to buy it without a doubt. Because it costs £1,674 or something. I'm not sure exactly. Ah. We found more level up people. I mean looters. Little do they know that their sole purpose in life is to help me level up my troops so they're more powerful. Okay, friend. Stay calm. Stay calm. Excellent. Okay, we've got to try and get my inventory to get more kills here. So... The thing is, though, fighting looters is really scary because the looters are better than your normal troops, which is pretty crazy. Um, okay, man, are you ready? At least at level one. They got double the skills at level one. Also, I, you know, I don't know if anyone's noticed, by the way. I'm not sure if this is... Because I haven't played Bandalore yeah! in the new patch, apart from this mod. Is this normal now? Are bows normally, like, silenced? <laughs> is, this a, is this a bug in the mod, or is this a bug in the, in the game now? <laughs> it's like, we have the most stealthy bow in the world. We have ninja bows. These guys are very casual. If I was them, I would probably be running towards my enemies quick, 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 quicker than them. Oh no, he magicked it. Don't mind me, friends. Oh. How dare you? We got this. Unfortunately, I can't even load up my character really without two handed weapon as well, so we need to get that sorted out as soon as possible. Oh, I should be careful though. I'm going to leave you alive, sir. I mean, we need my men to level up. Men! It's a kill them all! Go! Okay, I shall I kill him with the bow. Oh no <laughs> Good shot, man! Good shot! 
what are they doing? <laughs> what is the point of looters in this game? <laughs> oh no! We gotta get out of here! Wait, quickly before we leave! Okay, leave, leave, leave! No, 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 no! We escaped. <laughs> Let me know in the comments, everyone. Should I, I? I know how to get rid of that voice file. I might get rid of it. We'll see. But um, it is a bit. It is a bit um, hyperactive, to say the least. <laughs> they are very passionate. They are very, very passionate. Okay, let's head north. I didn't even get to see if anybody leveled up. <gasps> they did. Okay, so let's have a look. So as I mentioned yesterday, we are going to try and use these manly soldiers as our main guys because they look absolutely awesome. Well, maybe not this guy, but later on they look absolutely awesome. If I go and find some low, high level ones, let's go and see if we can find them. Trident Guard. He looks like a badass. And we also got other people such as the Guardian of the Trident, who are just gigantic sword people. Is this just a one-handed sword? Is that correct? We'll find out eventually. But I need to try and level them up. So I kind of want to wait a little bit. Because if I get him a horse, he can actually join me as cavalry. Now, I don't really want to use cavalry because cavalry is not exactly the best thing in the game right now. But we will have to make them into cavalry temporarily and then into the white knife, which goes down this path to get the super soldier with the super sword. So that's going to be the plan anyway. But horses are, can be a little bit expensive. So we'll leave them alone. Northern Halfblood. I think these guys turn into a different types of unit. So you can get Northern Wolf Guards. You can get uh, Stark Mounted Wolves, Car Stark Mounted Sun. Is that meant to be Sun as in Father and Son? Or Sun as in... I don't know. <laughs> it seems weird that it would be called Sun. But then again, they do have a giant white sun on their thing. So maybe it is Sun. Who knows? Let me know, guys. Um, okay, so let's have a look. So I kind of want to get some cavalry at some point. Just because cavalry is a staple of, well, this time period anyway. But if I do, I feel like I should probably get this guy. Because this guy has by far the highest stats I've seen. Uh, was it 260 pole arm? And also, I think he has probably some better armor. No, it's 30. <laughs> the armor is exactly the same as every well, nearly the same as everybody else's armor. Hmm. I mean, I, I have to think about it. I have to think about it. We might just be able to turn them into more horsemen to get more guardians of trident, though. So I might do that as well. We'll leave that alone for now as well. Uh, but you, my friend, get to level up. So something I have noticed about this, by the way, is a bit strange, is that all these units have pretty much exactly the same equipment, but they level up like one item at a time. So like, uh, for instance, uh, they have, well, the basic archer. Then I think they get some like better arrows and then they get a helmet. They get like a cape. <laughs> it's, pretty, it's pretty random, but they're pretty much exactly the same unit. They just get better skills. But I think the bow is always the same U-Bow. So, um, yeah, it's a bit strange, but it is what it is. Okay, let's carry on. So what I'm going to do as well, I'm not going to do tournaments exclusively. I'm also going to try and do some other stuff. So we might try and get some companions um, and also try and take down... Oh, there's a tournament here. Perfect. And also try and take down some gangs because I don't know when they got rounded back in, but gangs seem to be back in the game. <gasps> oh my god! I don't want to fight you. I'm hiding inside Harrenhal. Okay, before we go in, though, we must check. Ooh! This is, uh, I think it's from uh, one of the mods in base game. Nice. But that is not the armor we're taking, though. That is not the armor we're taking. Ooh. Oh, that's a bit too wide for me. I like my current helmet anyway, though. I might get, like, a neck plate, though, like this. I think this is pretty cool. When we get up, I'm going to get this, and we we'll use it when later on we get my proper armor as well. Uh, while I'm here, though, is there a sword? Please let there be a sword. <gasps> oh, Targaryen Kingsguard sword. I'll take it. Sold. Excellent. I can also sell some of the stuff here as well to get some money back. We only got to pay £550. I'm happy with that. Uh, let's sell this other stuff as well. I think we should made a profit here. Oh, we have. Beautiful. More money. Excellent. Okay. Let's wait here for some time. Let them pass a little bit. And also, now it's morning. Let's go and actually do the battle, uh, the tournament. If I'm lucky, I might even just get the uh, armor piece I want in the tournament. You never know. Ah, oh, it's not javelins. Okay, I'll take that, I guess. <laughs> oh, it's a battalion place, this one. Oh, that's a bit high. Come on. We got this. Uh oh. Uh oh, oh die. don't do this to me. Don't 
Oh, he failed. Please! Oh no, he missed at point blank range! How dare you! Hide, Arthur! It's okay. Hello there. Oh, I can't even see what I'm doing! That was a close battle, everybody. <laughs> that was definitely a close. What happened to the fourth guy on my team? I didn't even see the Arthur Archer die. He must have got like, not attacked right at the start. Okay, we luckily for us, they keep making me use swords, and I happen to be very good at using swords. Okay, even though my character is pretty much die! incapable in every way, <laughs> he doesn't even know what he's doing. Oh no! I'm trying to kill the archers first because they can just randomly kill me at any point. So we're not trying. <laughs> he just shrugged it off. It's not a problem. One down. Oh, we're about to lose the men. Can we shoot over this? One down. Oh, this is looking bad, everybody. This is looking bad. I used the mouse wheel. The mouse wheel. I think I need to, like, tape up the mouse wheel so I stop using it by mistake. Well, everybody, we failed this one. <laughs> I'm going to shock that up to mouse wheel killed me. Um, why? Do I don't even know how I do it, everybody. I've like a, I've got like a, I've got like a nervous tick where I just scroll the mouse wheel for no reason and people die. Oh man, imagine if I was like in charge of like a, like a, like an important thing is I just completely missed it because of the mouse wheel. I've been mad. Okay, let's go back over this way after my shameful display of uh, mouse wheel death. And let's go and see if we can get ourselves some cool armor in the north. Also over here as well, we might be able to go and visit Winterfell to see the uh, the custom throne they built for that. I don't think there's dragons there, because I don't think there's ever dragons there, but at least we can have a look at it. Um, ooh, no, there's someone here. I am going to try and keep checking for troops. Oh, I thought you were an enemy for a second, sir. The red, sh I thought, I saw the red first. I was like, it's an enemy. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Oh, no, as I mentioned uh, yesterday, everybody, there is no troops in this mod. I don't know how. I played for like um, a few hours in the test game, and there was still no troops in the. <gasps> yes, we got some. Take that, Benjin. Wait, why are you just running around? I guess this is before you joined the uh, Night's Watch or something. Who knows? Who knows? Okay, so we want to try and swing around. Let's just go into here. Ah, oh. Bernie. You're ruining my life here. You stole all my troops. What are you doing? Winterfell, do you have some cool stuff? Unsullied shield, ooh. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> That's very large. I feel like it's like a giant, like, uh, uh, pot lid or something. I feel like I'm, I should be making a dinner with it, but who knows. Okay, let's get rid of that. Uh, oh, wait, it's also a Bolton shield. Oh, my God, that's huge. That's not even a drawing, everybody. That is a full-on flayed man in that on that shield there. Um, also... I'm just pointing this out. Surely, like in the in the TV show, if there was a guy in your faction that had a giant flag like this, they are clearly going to be bad guys. They're not going to be good. Why would you trust them? <laughs> I'm just going to say. I know I'm, I know it's in hindsight, of course, but I mean, come on. They're, they're clearly horrible people. Uh, okay, let's have a look. So, anything here? Ooh, so, I am just going to look at some random armor sometimes, though, because oh, this looks pretty badass. This is, oh, this guy, oh, oh, we're not, we're not this guy, either. we're not this guy, but that does look pretty good. When this one gets more refined, we have to try and do like a multiple playthroughs and do like a uh, Lannister one and stuff like that. Especially when the story gets added in, so I think that'd be quite interesting when the story gets added in properly, so you have like story events. Also, you can get start, oh, that's a very high def cloak, that is. There we are, I want the uh, thing plate instead. Valerian steel armor. Now, this is actually very good, by the way. The armors, like I said, the values aren't really in the game yet, so they just look cool. They're not actually um, set up yet. <gasps> we found it. My armor. Wait, there's two different types of armor. Oh, this one looks better. This is the armor we're going to go with. This one's very um, knightish. I like this one quite, quite a lot. So now we've got that armor thing, though. We also need to try and get ourselves some gloves. Well, I'm not sure how much armor is actually going to help me in this one because everyone's got the same armor value, but I think it's more of like an aesthetic look thing at this point. Um, let's see. Are there any good gloves anywhere? I like how you can kind of mix and match between different things, though. I think that is a pretty cool feature they've added in. Uh, also, this is like an ancient Stark set. I, I saw someone when I was playing earlier. It's like a really weird ancient armor. It's pretty, it's pretty cool, though. 
Hmm, I can't see much. We'll leave that for now, though, because I need to keep some money for more tournaments down the line. Okay, so now that we've got that sorted out, I'm feeling pretty good about myself. We're going to see if there's any recruits. So there's not. Okay, so I'm going to try... Oh, you get another sword first. We're going to make more money from the tournaments, unfortunately. And when I get enough money now, I'm going to get myself a second set of armor and also some companions that we're going to use to go and t uh, beat up some gang members to get our, um, some money that way as well. Uh, friend. Tournaments nearby. Barrowton and something else. Okay. Let's go have a look. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Let's go. So also, while I'm talking about companions, if you haven't watched me before, um, I do a thing where pretty much if anybody leaves a comment uh, with a name and like what kind of person they want, like a name, um, like who they are, uh, what kind of like if they're infantry, archers, ca uh, cavalry, all, not, all that kind of stuff. I put them in a random list on my Discord and then I uh, pick them randomly and put them into the game as companions because I got a little mod called Character Reader that lets me rename and um, change their skills around that kind of stuff to add them to the game. So um, it, feel free to do that if you want to see the comment below in the video. Uh, if you know that I've seen the comment if I reply to it because I reply to everyone. And also, you can only have one per person. Do not give me multiple names. I will call you up on it. <laughs> Trust me. It will happen. It will happen. Okay, apart from that, let's move on. So I'll try and get some later on as well, because companions are quite cheap, and of course, armor is very cheap. So there's no reason not to get a nice little group of companions going right away, really. Oh, it's a bunch of 1v1s. Okay, let's have a look. Wait. Oh, there they are. <laughs> it's like, I can't see anybody. They could be anywhere. Hey. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, sir. Hit it. Oh, powerful. Oh, hail the flying rock. <laughs> I don't know. Why is developers put so many flying rocks in the game? I, I don't understand. It doesn't make any sense. Oh, no. Oh, no. I've been given a pole arm in a tournament. We have to kill the axe man. No, no, no target. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Uh, can you wait for me, buddy? Wait, buddy, you're too fast. I'm not, I'm not strong enough for this. I, I can't contain the weight of this armor. This guy is very tanky. I'll, I'll join you, friend. Oh, never mind. Good job, man, good job. Yeah, <laughs> very energetic. Are you by chance a voice actor of the uh, King of the North? He might be. You never know. Yeah. There was a lot of them. Oh, that one is that. Kind of what though. <laughs> that was a bit close. Let's try and take down the horseman first. Or oh, maybe not. Let's try and take down the spearman first. Tag team, buddy. Oh, I like how I hit his shield even though I completely missed. <laughs> How dare you, sir. I love my limbs. I'm just going to let my friend kill you. Don't mind me. Oh, wait. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Good job. Victory! I thought you just said retreat, but I think you said victory. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure what you said there. Oh, no. This is not a fun way of finishing a tournament, everybody. They should really remove pole arms from these. Let's stab each other for five minutes. going to be the longest battle what you've ever seen. <laughs> Just let it happen, sir. Someone has to fall today and it won't be me. Come on, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Be a man. Got him. <laughs> imagine, imagine paying. Being a paying citizen and going to watch a tournament and the last bout is some guys stabbing each other with some very long sticks. It would not be very... Unless you're into that kind of thing, I guess. But for me, that's not what I want to see. Um, okay, we've done it. we got even more money. I think we have some boots as well. Let's see if these are actually any good. Love this cutscene. Okay. Do you know what? It's better than what we're wearing right now, so we'll take it, we'll take it. Uh, what am I wearing for my after after um, combat clothes? Okay, so as I mentioned, some all these armors as well are also available in civilian. So before I go and start going to fight some random... Um, uh, what is, is this? What, <laughs> is this from Tron? 
Oh, it's so powerful. <laughs> okay, it's not as trony as I thought it was. I thought it was like a weird, like, display helmet. It was like something from a Spartan. Okay, but also there's no reason for our civilian gear that we can't go and make ourselves like a different look as well. So we might try and find like a very different type of look and uh, have that for our civilian gear. So we kind of have like two different types at the same time. Uh, but for now, we're going to carry on. So let's actually go and hire. Oh, wait, before I say that, did I make some... I, I put the boots on, didn't I? I forgot. <laughs> it's been five seconds. I've already forgotten what I'm doing. Okay. Um, rival gang moving in. Whatever. I don't care. No recruits available here. Are there companions? No. Let's try and find ourselves a companion that I can name for tomorrow's episode. And then we'll see if we can go and uh, destroy some gangsters and get some money that way as well. I do... It's a bit weird that I have to kind of play this way. Because, of course, I wouldn't normally play this way at all. Because... Uh, but, like, the kind of the basic version of the game is kind of broken in that you can't do what you normally do. I think the mod is definitely designed to be played where you just spawn yourself in with a castle and you have, like, a big army at the start. Um, but, like I said, as soon as the wars start... Uh, by the way, we have to wait a little bit because wars take a while to start on this. So I don't think there are any wars yet. No. If I look around, I'm pretty sure there should be no wars in the game yet. No, not really. So I think the... They're all two, they've got non-aggression packs. Now, I have done the thing with the uh, Diplomacy mod, which works with this mod, where I've reduced the time of uh, non-aggression packs down by, I think, like, a massive margin. I think it stands like 10 days or something. So, uh, hopefully, once they run out, the non-aggression packs, we should start seeing some combat, and then we can go and join in, like, a random army in, like, a random place and fight some big battles. That's what I want to do. That's going to be really fun. And also, as we have such a high companion army we might even end up just having like a large companion army at the start because we can't find any recruits so i can get 22 companions which is gonna be really cool we get like a nice like viewer based companion army and we just run around and kill everybody i think it'll be pretty awesome um i just got four recruits that's amazing that's like the most i've seen this entire time oh oh this space and it's the recruits I want. It's not just basic recruits. It's the recruits I need. I just punched the mic. I'm sorry. It's the recruits I need for my army. It's absolutely amazing. Uh, okay, so while we're here, I just mostly wanted to stop by to see if I can get myself a companion. So, is there companions here? Uh, yes, there was one. Simon the Scholar or Tommen of the Hills? I pick... They, I'm not gonna lie, they're both, they don't look, they don't look like very capable people. <laughs> what are their stats? I don't know what that really matters, because I'm gonna get rid of, uh, change them over anyway. This guy has some very fine clothing though. And also, sir, you need to, get, you need to find a better headhunt picture, because this does not do you justice, sir. You look a lot cooler. But what about this guy? No, this guy just looked like his picture. You have honest opinion, friend. You are very honest. Tommen, I think I'm gonna hire you, my friend. Oh wait, I thought for a second, it said it, I, they were going to pay me minus £842. No, okay. <laughs> I pay you? No, you pay me. We're not sure, we're not sure. Okay, we got a guy, this is perfect. Um, and let's move on. We got some more troops as well. My speed should be still pretty high, because the game gives you some very high movement speed as a base. I think base it gives you plus 4.5, so everyone runs around quickly. Mostly because the map is gigantic as we all know it's i can't even zoom out the whole way it's just absolutely huge i i think it's like three or four times the size of base games map it's pretty mad but yes okay so let's run around so we might be able to find some looters to end up today's video if not we're uh carry on our little tournament thing tomorrow and maybe try and kill some gangsters which should hopefully get us some money um is there no one here <laughs> it's too late fretex all the bandits are dead there's no one left alive. It's just people trying to find lords, uh, recruits for their armies. That's all it is. To be fair, though, if everybody's being recruited, there will be no unemployment. So that's probably why the looters aren't around, because there's no crime. It's a perfect system, everybody. Perpetual War. I think it's in a, I think it's in like a, um, a TV show somewhere, like a, a Magna. I can't remember what exactly where it is. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. Okay, let's do that instead. I see you, sir. Now I've got one after this one, because the twins, when my testing, crashed every time I tried to do this tournament, so we might not be able to do it there. We might have to avoid that one. Um, I don't know why it crashes, but I guess it just does, unfortunately. Okay, men. Look at him. He's so beautiful. Tommen of the Hills, you'll be renamed tomorrow to a random companion name. But for now, men, it's time to prove who you follow. For the, the king of the north. And the random guy at the back. <laughs> you don't charge it. You just stay where you are. Okay, now I've got myself a real sword as well. Let's actually go a bit forward. 
Get off my horse, and we're gonna charge in like a badass. It's time! Let's go. I've got tactics. I don't know how, because I'm not doing any tactics at all, but apparently it's, it's counting. I have no fear. Fight me. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Hit me. Oh no! Man, help me! <laughs> I have fear, man! Help me, man! By the way, the entire time I was doing that, I was actually leaning against the edge of my chair. I don't know why, because it didn't really help me at all, but um, it is what it is. The battle is over, friend. Is that the. Is that the. Um, that's, I, I recognize that voice. Is that the guy that reads the, total, uh, the Warhammer books? <laughs> He's in this as well. He's everywhere. Okay, I, I prefer this voice track. It's not some guy shouting King of North for 10 minutes, that's for sure. Come on, Bo. Please. No. Please. please. No, that was my... His hat just disappeared. He's shedding his armor. Okay, I can't even commit this ring anyway then. Okay, victory. And nobody died. Uh, 0 0.8 right now. Imagine. Imagine trying to live off this. But we did manage to get ourselves a rusty noble stark sword. I might actually keep that as my ooh, my secondary sword for now, just so I have a two-handed sword I could use in the uh, bandit areas. Okay, done. So before I end up today's video as well, I'm going to go and look at um, my skills because I haven't done it today. We've leveled up twice, which is pretty awesome. We got three new perks, so I'm going to probably try and increase my athletics as soon as possible. Uh, because I want to get as fast as soon as possible. We're going to get ourselves 3% more movement speed. My mouse is breaking again. No, no mouse. Not like this. Okay, more movement speed. Beautiful. Um, I'm not going to use the horse much, but we'll go for nimble speed so I can get more skills for my units. Uh, and for bow, we're going to pick the headshot damage one so we can get more skills. And also, like I said, captain skill, more uh, archery skills for your units. Done. Perfect. So, done. Apart from that, everybody. I hope that you've enjoyed today's episode. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.